so in my neighborhood there's a couple of interracial relationships um and today i told you they always let me know that they know who i am because these are possessed black men who are um with possessed white women now they're um the tip this particular couple are the typical um the typical image of what they normally look like young skinny somewhat attractive black guy oversight overweight white female and a bunch of serpent seeds like they must have two or three kids um Anyhow, they always let me know that they know who I am. Today when I'm walking down the street, from where he is, he can't even see my shoes, what they say or not. I got these off of eBay for 23 bucks. I had a choice. I could either spend $60, $70 on a pair of name brand tennis shoes, or I could get these trainers that serve the purpose for a for much cheaper price. I chose to go with the trainers because they serve their purpose. I'm able to walk as much as I need to with them. But I'm walking and he goes, excuse me, <laughs> they never speak to me. Excuse me, um, where did you get those shoes from? They told me, mind you the government already was mad that I chose these shoes over spending money on the more expensive shoe they wanted me to buy a Nike they, they wanted an, they wanted and expected me to buy a Nike so they go on and they're like, well, we're going to, you know, pretty much attempt to make you insecure about these shoes. We're going to see how confident you truly are. Today I'm walking, excuse me, where did you get those shoes? I'm like, oh, I got them on eBay. He's like, oh, those are fire. Um, like, what are, what are they? I said, can you see what they say? I said, are you able to see what they say? And he, um... He goes, he goes, um, um, no, I said, they say human race. He said, what are those Adidas? I said, no, I don't know what brand they are. And he's like, oh, them fire. And I said, all right. <laughs> but. But, 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 just like they know who I am, they know that I know who they are. And, yeah. And you win those in a thought are at, like, an all-time high. These are people that would have normally... And I've been in an interracial relationship before. I've actually been in two. But it's one of those things when you know better, you do better. Like the more I learned about, the more I developed as a human being, that's one of the reasons I would never get married. Back then I wouldn't allow to get married and I always backed out of marriages. But it's because what I thought in terms of the evolution of me and me evolving as a person, I couldn't allow myself to settle. And, uh, but you know better, you do better, you develop, you learn more. And, yeah, I never do another interracial relationship ever. And whether I, do I condone in them? No. But it's not like I'm hateful either against it. You know, I don't have that. There's no hate associated with it. So no, I don't condone it, but there's no hate. But that's what I was going to say. Normally when people see you doing for yourself, it's, it's applauding. You know, like, normally no one has anything bad to say about that. But in my case, I told you I'm surrounded by theirs. Truly. So, they, um, 
these people whose situation appear to be better than mine. You know, I'm when I say appear to be better, meaning they're not hurting to get what they want. And they have a way of getting around. And they, you know, do whatever they do. Do whatever they do. They're not going through the type of struggle that I'm going through. Because they've accepted the devil, the devil as their savior. The government is their savior. And I'll be honest with you. When he said, what are those Adidas? I wanted to say, what are you, a coon? But that would have just made me seem a little aggressive. I don't know how though, because that's the thing about it. When you know what you're dealing with, like I know I'm dealing with the devil. Like, and the devil tries to be slick and sneaky about it. And I'm up front and in your face about it. You know, so I don't, I don't know why that, you know what you're trying to do. You know what you intended to do. So why would you get mad if somebody calls you on your shit? Why would you try to cover it up? They said her hair is doing stuff that don't nobody want her hair to be doing. She has some new growth. Yes, they like the way I handled the shoe situation because they put $10 in my pocket.